I'm here with Dr. Webster Pilcher. Um, you know, he's a surgeon that trains other doctors to be surgeons. How cool is that? So I thought it'd be fun to ask him a few questions because when do I ever get a person like this to ask questions of? I mean, what's it like to train residents and is this stressful? Well, Brian, I haven't seen you in 25 years. <laughs> and uh, can you imagine training you? Um, wow. but, but obviously, um, it's an incredible honor to um, take care of patients and to have the opportunity to help them operate on the brain and spine and to teach you to operate. And you were a phenomenal resident. You became a great surgeon. Nothing could make me happier. Wow. Very humbling. And you know, after 25 years, I was lucky enough to come back and see what you've done with this program. And you asked me to speak to the residents. I mean, um, what is it? What does it mean to you to have a resident like me who trained under you come back and then talk to the residents that you're currently training? Well, I think one of our most important missions is training the next generation of neurosurgeons, um, people who are going to go out for 25, 30, 40 years uh, and in the middle of the night save lives. And I can say you know, I trained at this program for seven years. We got the best training in the world, I think. It was one of the best times of my life for seven years. Our greatest success um, is to have people like uh, Dr. Hoflinger, Brian Hoflinger, come back after 25 years, and then to realize how many lives he's touched and uh, that we've achieved our objective as a training program. Because yeah. I'll tell you, neurosurgery is cool.